Hey guys, Devin O'Rourke here, back with another video, and today I'm going to be showing you my top 5 most overrated Godzilla films. I'd like to point out that you guys are watching this while I'm on vacation, that is because this video is pre-made. I'd also like to point out that before these overrated films are shown through this list, none of these films, just because they're overrated, are bad films. I just think they're overrated. Well, scratch that if you count the last two. Anyways, without further ado, enjoy the video. At number 5, we have Godzilla vs. Mothra 1964. Now, as I said earlier, these movies, despite the fact they're overrated, are good. They're just overrated because people maybe like them a little bit too much, and that's why I'm making this video. And that's simply the case with Godzilla vs. Mothra. And how I describe Godzilla vs. Mothra is, it's good, but not that good. It's entertaining, but not that entertaining. And I think people really only love it because it's the first time Mothra ever really made an appearance, not because of the movie itself, which at many times could get a little bit boring. As a last point, I also think this movie doesn't do a good job at exhibiting any real thrill like other Godzilla films. At number 4 we have Invasion of Astro Monster. Now similar to Godzilla vs. Mothra, I once again say that this is indeed a good movie, it's just a little bit overrated and that's why I'm putting it in this list. I'm also aware that I could be coming across as a little bit biased because I'm one of the people that thinks Ghidorah the Three-Headed Monster is better than Invasion of Astro Monster, which it is. However, it's not just that. I also think this movie is pretty much a copy and paste repeat of Ghidorah the Three-Headed Monster with the settings and kaiju and everything, but this still is a very good movie. At number three, we have Godzilla vs. Destroya. Now before all you Heisei fans get mad at me, I want to make clear that I am a big Heisei fan myself, but I just don't really have any exact problems with Godzilla vs. Destroya. It's just everything about him, the whole Godzilla burning design, Destroya, all the elements that make Godzilla vs. Destroya a good film is just kind of overhyped and overloved by many G-fans, and that's why I just simply think it's overrated. However, it is once again a good movie, despite the fact it is overrated in my opinion. At number two, we have GMK, or otherwise known as Godzilla, Mothra, and King Ghidorah All Out Attack. That's right guys, GMK is no longer in the phase of being an overrated movie that's also good. It's also an overrated movie and a bad movie. Like, what is this? What? Like, what? So yeah, you get the picture. In my opinion, this movie's overrated because it's so cheesy and corny. Like, come on. <laughs> Not only that, but unlike other people, I actually don't like the designs in this film, such as ones of Godzilla and Mothra, but I can respect the fact they brought Baragon back, like that is pretty cool. At number one, the crown goes to Godzilla Final Wars. God, is this movie overrated, my god! That's right guys, number one is Godzilla Final Wars. It's not even a matter at this point of if it's overrated or not, it's just in my mind, how can anybody look at this movie and say, Alright, this is a pretty good film. Now, I would agree with you, however, if you were to have said, Oh my god, this movie is a so bad, it's good film. But keep in mind, that's a so bad, it's good film. Other than that, everything in this movie is extremely overkill. It's pretty much just setting by setting Godzilla fighting a brand new kaiju. Now, don't get me wrong, this is the kind of movie a young Godzilla fan like myself would have liked, but growing older, you have to understand that with a movie like this where the human story is practically non-existent, it's so idiotic. The acting is also pretty bad, because they expect us to believe that a lot of these characters are quote, badass, but like, really? I knew that tuna head wasn't up to much. There you go guys, that is the end of my top 5 most overrated Godzilla films list. I hope in the end, now that this video is over, you can respect my opinion. And I also hope you guys enjoyed the video as a whole. Anyways guys, like, comment, subscribe, see you guys later, and bye bye